now we are going to look at how do we perform evaluation of expressions okay evaluation of expressions obviously an expression is having more than one operators in it okay it's a combination of operators up till now we have seen the algorithms how to evaluate a particular operator now we are going to see how to evaluate a combination of operators so let's suppose my expression is r natural join s union t or for that matter let's suppose intersection t okay so i'm going to help you in decide how do we evaluate such kind of expressions okay this is my expression okay there is one operator over here there is another operator over here so there are two ways two basic ways to do this the first method is called as materialization in materialization what we do is first i am going to calculate t1 okay which would be our natural join s i am going to store t1 into the disk i am going to calculate then t2 which is what which is t intersection t1 okay so that is how we use materialization in materialization we store the intermediate result into the disk we materialize the intermediate results okay that is the concept of materialization the other method is that of pipelining in pipelining what we do is let's suppose i have let's suppose my r natural join s has in its result 100 tuples so in pipelining what we are going to do is as in when some tuples are generated in the natural join i give these tuples to the next operator which is intersection so here as in when the tuples are generated in or rather as tuples are generated in the natural join or in our natural join s give them to intersection operator give them to intersection operator so that we can calculate what we can calculate the intersection with r so let's suppose i have 100 and after 10 seconds i have generated 10 of these tuples so i give these 10 tuples to the intersection operator and find 10 intersection t okay these are 10 tuples so now after some time i will get another 20 i'll do the intersection with these 20 up till this we i'm going to keep doing this until all 100 tuples are generated and at the end of these operations i would get the entire intersection of these 100 tuples with the t relation okay so in this case we do not store the intermediate result rather we pipeline the operations in such a manner that as in when some tuples are generated it is given to the next operation which is requiring those tuples to perform certain task for in our example we had the intersection operator which is was waiting for the natural join natural joined tuples to perform the intersection okay so that is the concept of pipelining now let's look at materialization in a bit further detail okay materialization let's suppose i want to find out the employees and their department name who have salary greater than 50000 okay my employee table is something like this i have name just for the sake of simplicity i am saying 